Hi, good morning everyone. Uh, thanks for checking back in. Today I wanted to talk about your squat and uh, just an interesting cue that I've uh, been liking to use and, and you'll hear a lot of other fitness professionals use it. Uh, thinking about the squat movement, uh, pretty common movement. We've been doing it since we could basically stand up because we'll squat right back down. As a baby, we do it pretty well and, and generally through life, uh, as we move into adulthood, we kind of unteach ourselves uh, this movement pattern that we actually have pretty good at when we first initially start moving. So, um, thinking about your squat, there's a lot of different cues that you'll hear. Some common ones would be, you know, sitting back into your hips, driving through your heels, keeping your posture upright, taking uh, strong breaths, maybe even so far as to take your pelvis and tuck it underneath, right, to prevent, uh, to keep a little bit more core control. Uh, but one thing that, that you'll hear as well, and, and what I especially want to focus on in this video, is spreading the floor with the knees. Um, when we set up in this squat, you know, the last thing we want is our knees to come in and, and create this kind of valgus knee effect. What we want to do is, is spread the floor with the knees and let the knees track outside. To do that, um, what I will do is I'm going to put my feet to the floor and there's a lot of different squatting positions, um, you know, as far as your foot stance, whether it's narrow, wider, slightly turned out, a little bit more neutral. Um, depending on who you are and what you're doing and how you move, there might be a better style for you. I would definitely meet with a trainer or a strength coach um, to let them kind of go over where you're at and really what you're trying to get out of it. But um, just for the purpose of today, just starting in this neutral position here, and really what I want to do is almost like dig my grip the floor with my toes, digging them in, and I'm gonna almost spread them outward. So it'd be like I'm drawing my foot outside, but it's into the floor. What that's doing, it's making me abduct my hips, right? That lateral uh, control of my hips, that abduction is firing my glutes. That's what's making my glute, my hip, activate and wanna take over the movement. So when I come through, I want to spread the floor on the way down and then smooth up. So I don't want to change the transition and let them buckle in. I want to keep them out nice and smooth. And you can really feel, especially the size of the glutes, as you come up out of there. Right? Um, so there's just a quick tip. Think about spreading the floor with the knees and the feet um, in your squat. Definitely talk to one of our trainers on staff if you'd like your squat looked at. Um, and we'll go from there. All right, take care.